Hey guys, how's it going? Welcome back to Pen Pal. So we are going to work on the good ending. Now, I do want to preface this by saying I did talk to a couple of my friends on Discord and they all teased me because they're like, well, you should have gotten the good ending with the combination you did. You just didn't do it right. No idea what that was supposed to mean, but supposedly I'm supposed to find more letters between Laura and Larry. And I guess I missed them. So... I had to watch my first video to figure out what notes I did pick. Let's go. So in this one, I'm just going to scan through the letters. I'm not necessarily going to read them in depth like I did the first time. So please check out that first video if you haven't seen it already so that you can get the story from all the letters. Um, if I do find more or new letters, then I'll put those. All right, so this is the first one, Larry. Don't have anyone to talk to. Anything happens in your life, ba 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 ba. So I hope to hear back from you. Okay, so we're gonna go upstairs and write him another letter, <laughs> or at least write him a letter. So I have played this a couple other times. Um, at some point, I'll probably put all those videos together and maybe make like a little highlight. Uh, the one time I played. The TV turned on and I think there was news that there was a killer on the loose and he was leaving people letters and then Larry was actually at the end of this hallway in that window. That actually did kind of make me jump. Let's get this. So I know there was this one in the trash can. Larry talking to Laura, he can't live without her. All right, so. So like I said, I did go back and watch my first video to see which letter I had picked, like the order in which I picked them. Um, Exchanging letters sounds acceptable to me. So I believe this was the first letter I had picked even in the beginning. So we'll do this one. And of course, the amount I was getting picked on was pretty comical, but I do have to give them credit for kind of helping me in the... Because I wanted to have a video out on Thursday, and if you didn't notice, there was no video released on Thursday. Um... A lot of other things were going on in uh, my personal life. Nothing bad, just other things I had to attend to. And I was working on trying to get the good ending for this one. And it just was not working for me. Like I said, I got a lot of bad endings and kind of got other little storylines, I'm going to say, that I saw. So yeah, I want to revisit this with the suggestion of some of my friends from Discord and people that have been watching my videos, so I appreciate you guys. I hope this is the way I'm supposed to be doing it. Now, I do remember there was one letter near the switch box. Yep, there it is. I do remember this letter. Oh, we haven't seen each other in months. Haven't spoken to her since it happened. Been putting on a smile. So I remember that. Because I think I got two, if I'm not mistaken, I thought we had two letters from, oh, well, with the interaction between Laura and Larry. So we'll see where that goes and see if I still get that one. If not, I will have to just continue trying. <laughs> Fantastic. Super excited to have someone to talk to. Yes, he does. Yes, yes. So, and then I'm gonna try to give you guys time to pause this as well in case you do want to read it or if this is the first time you've seen this video so that you guys have that opportunity so hopefully I'm not moving too fast go upstairs and write a reply I remember having a pen pal when I was younger and uh, I don't remember my pen pal shoving letters under my door so I kind of feel like this would be weird anyway <laughs> but Okay, so the one in the trash, one by the fuse box. I guess that was the two. And then I think, hello, pleasure writing to you again. And I believe that was the same letter I picked last time, but again, I could be completely mistaken. So one thing that I would like to ask, deliver letters at such a, no. Cause I think the one time I picked the letter on the left, I think he got kind of offended. I thought. See, I'm confusing myself all over again. Let's just do this one. 
I do prefer dogs over cats. Because I think I was trying to play it where I didn't, um, what do you want to call it? I, I didn't want to like offend him, but I also didn't want to give him too much information about my coming and goings as far as when I work, what time I get up, all that good stuff. So come on, go to bed. There we go. Rest your head and mail the letter in the morning. You feel a sense of unease that you can't imagine why. I remember that being a, <laughs> that was always a prompt. <laughs> I always seem to get that one, so I'm kind of getting nervous that maybe, maybe I was lied to. I don't know. We'll see. If so, this would just end up being another uh, blooper, blooper highlight reel on another video. Alright, let's see. Ooh, wait. There's a new letter. I found your new address. Why did you move? I just wanted another chance. Is that too much to ask? It's been so long since I've seen you, but I'll finally be able to see you tonight. You thought you could just forget about me because I never forgot about you. Not for a second since you left. You thought you could just leave me like I'm nothing. I saw your new boyfriend too. Seems like a great guy. If only he treated you as well as I did. If you're reading this, I'm upstairs right now. I heard you come in and I'm heading downstairs right now. Don't bother calling the cops. I cut the phone lines. And why would you want to leave? I have a wonderful smile to share with you. I can't wait to hold you again. And this time, I won't let you go. Sincerely, Larry. Woof. Uh, my pen pal has officially lost his mind. He's not upstairs. No. Okay, wait. I almost was going to freak out and say, oh, is he upstairs? And everything went dark. Wait. Wait, no. Oh, God. <laughs> I was just stuck in a corner like a, like a dum dum. All right, cool. Well, cool for me, not for Laura. Doesn't sound like that something was behind me. Not going well for her apparently. No worries about, no worries at all about you asking about my life. Okay. Have you ever been in a relation that just didn't work out? So this is the last letter he had sent me, and I thought I had offended him. I know it's a very personal question, so I won't mind if you don't answer. So I thought this time he was offended by the answer I gave him. Because I remember what I said. Like, you know, it's a give and take. It's, you know, objective. So, um... Go upstairs and write a reply. But I kept being told that that was the correct option. But I'm not so... I don't even know, because I feel like I've run the gambit on options. There's Larry. Okay. I don't know if that was good or bad. Because that happened in the bad ending. And I remember seeing him. I thought I was in the living room. But we'll see. Yeah, so Larry definitely. I'm assuming he killed Laura. So the one I did was hi there again. You know. But you also have to acknowledge what you may have done wrong because in my experience, the sooner you come to terms with your own faults, the easier it is to deal with the breakup. Is there any reason that you ask? Maybe I'll answer. I th no, I did the right one. Like the, the letter on the right. <laughs> I remember doing this one. So I, I'm just going to do it again and see if this works. Although I feel like I'm in the right direction because I got another letter. And I'm assuming from the conversations I've had, it seems like every time you choose the right answer or the right letter, you're hearing more story from Laura and Larry. But with all the other twists and turns I've gotten, it seems that Larry's totally crazy and out of his mind. A true friend can be hard to find. I wonder if that's the prompt I got last time. It didn't know, but I kind of have a bad feeling that maybe I did not do this right. Better go answer the door. Okay, I was told look and look and look. Yeah, I'm not. Every time I come down the stairs, I keep thinking that the, um, the coat hang by my front door is Larry. Hmm. Not seeing anything, so I don't know. Nope. 
guess as long as Larry doesn't just oogie boogie behind me, I should be okay. But we'll see. Worst case, it's another bad ending and it will be part of another clip. <laughs> Let's see. Thank you. Thank you very much. I've been looking for somebody to talk to for quite some time and through everyone I've written, I haven't come across any someone like you. Someone that actually cares and means to help. Someone who understands. I've made mistakes before, Thomas. Big mistakes. I'm trying my best every day to make up for them. It's just that sometimes I can't seem to let my mistakes go. I suppose everyone is like that deep down. Anyway, thank you again, Thomas, for your help. I greatly appreciate it. I hope we cross paths again one day. Please don't stop smiling. Larry. Okay, I haven't gotten that one before. So, is this good? Hi. Okay, wait, my lights didn't go all the way out. Aww, I love it. So, no way, no way, no way. Wait, is that the good ending? Please tell me it is. It has to be because I didn't die. <laughs> like every other time so wait a minute because if i'm not mistaken those are the same letters i picked in the very first video are you telling me i was that close to getting the good ending D i'm still like in shock you guys have no idea how many times i've actually played this because i'm sad <laughs> come on Yes! Yes! Oh, that's such a good feeling <laughs> to see good ending. Oh, I'm so happy. That makes me happy right there. Oof. All right, guys. We got the good ending. That was awesome. Larry uh, didn't, didn't murk me and cut my lights off, so that was good. Like I said, there was a lot of twists and turns to get there, so I appreciate my Discord friends for kind of pointing out that, you know, you're doing it right, you're just not doing it right at the same time. <laughs> anyway, guys, I really appreciate you so much for coming back and watching this one. If you're a returning sub, thank you so much for your support. If you are new to my channel, I hope you'll take a chance and subscribe. It's nice to have you here. Leave a comment down below what you thought of this one. Thumbs up if you'd like. And until next time, guys, please take care of yourselves. Know I love you and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.